You feel you're covered. Should we do the rest of this David Attenborough style? I just feel that we should. You want to thank him, but you don't have the strength to utter a single word. You feel your covers being pulled up over you as you are tucked in tightly. Good night, my colonel. In your dream, you're together with Colonel Sanders. For some reason, Sprinkles is also there, instructing your love. Dreams are weird. And that was the cast of the game, Riding Chicken. There we go. Okay, I know this might sound a little strange, but I think I might be, um, I think I might like Plank. Like him? Like, like, like. I know, it sounds like it's moving too fast, but there's something about him. I like him. Like, like him. It's canon. Miriam banged a robot. Just deal with that. KFC. I know that everything in the world is messed up right now. I know that. There's a lot of terrible things going on. But I just want you to remember that we live in the actual timeline where you can legally say, and be completely correct, KFC officially wrote a dating sim where a girl bangs a kitchen appliance. We live in that timeline. A lot of stuff is messed up. But you can say that, and it's correct. Hello Josh, this is my first time here after watching many of Josh's videos. I came in pursuit of RPG content and to have meaningful discussions about it, so can someone explain what this is? Grand King, this is the, this is the end game of RPGs. Where do you think RPGs eventually... Look, when you play a game, you want to play another game better than the previous one, and you want to slowly step your way up. So you start by playing... Baldur's Gate. It's a pretty good game. It's a good RPG. Then you go to Baldur's Gate 2. That's a better game. It's a better RPG. Then you go to Fortnite. That's a better game. That's a better RPG. Then you go to Barbie Race and Ride. And you start to look for all the little things. And ultimately, as you climb the ladder, you always, no matter where you start, end up at I Love You, Colonel Sanders. So, this summer while I was on vacation, a lovely man approached me in the botanical garden where I was working. This can't be good. He told me all about his passion for spices. Secret spices. The man even gave me some to show me what he meant. He said it was a powder created from super duper rare dried flower petals and that if I did him a big favour, I could have some of my own. Please, Miriam, don't tell me. So I filled my suitcase with them and brought them home. He was so nice. He even met me at the gate when I arrived. Later, when I cooked with them, a very strange feeling came over me, and the flavour was unlike anything I'd ever tasted. Miriam smuggled drugs from a country. Miriam, it was cocaine. That's what it was. It was opium. They weren't flowers, they were roses. All right, they were seeds. You are wanted in several countries. You are on many watch lists. You can't fly anywhere. If you go to certain countries in certain parts of Mexico, you'll get shot. That's the, Miriam, you have no idea how, how serious what you've done is. Before you can ask her to confirm that she was definitely not texting secrets to other people, you're interrupted. A wind rushes in. Cherry blossom petals fill the air. It's Conan's... <laughs> Why is he on a horse? Maybe, maybe KFC ran out of chicken. Maybe that's what they're like. Hey guys, this is a pretty big chicken drumstick here, Colonel. That's a horse leg. Okay, you don't sell horse meat. All right, you're not ASDA. You need to get that down to the lasagna at Tesco's. That's where that belongs. Under this white chocolate, it's a breast. It's a boob. Stepping inside Sander's home, surrounded by his things, you start to feel a special bond with him. Like, look at the pictures on the wall. Is that Pop Pop? I swear to God, he's been to Egypt. That's, that right there is the actual Colonel Sanders, that picture just there. Look at the chicken there. 
I used chicken very specifically because there is another word I could have used, but I chose not. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Interitus. I, I got there. I was going to say rooster. 